we are back. Um, back inside Dead Man's Island, moat, detached bastion, north centre bastion, the Smoky. Uh, there's loads of different names for this place, folks. And uh, I'm joined with Kyra in the front again, boy. There he is, the old folk. And we're actually going to the north lines. The north lines towards the drop out and the north entrance was cut through when they'd done a road through it. Cut through it. Yeah, the road cuts through the moats. They cut through it because uh, they wanted more traffic up here. Like big lorries and stuff because they had that big lorry park. Yeah, the north entrance wasn't big enough for, I suppose, today's standards, you know, well, 1960s standards rather. So 1967 they cut through it, destroying two water tanks of the north entrance, massive water storage tanks. Uh, one remains, but two others were destroyed. I mean, it's shocking. So we're going to another part of the north lines, which has not been cut through. It's not been cut through, but there is a bit of a climb. So I've got some rope and uh, I'm going to uh, free climb up the, the slippery chalk style cliff. It's like more of a bank, but... Yeah, that is high, isn't it? Could just try that wire. No, we're not using that. I'm going to pull that wire out of the way when I get up. <laughs> take it off. Just chuck it at the top. Oh, so dangerous. So there it is. That's where we. That's our uh, challenge, folks. That is massive. Is that about the wall? Yeah, really. This has collapsed. All this. This would have been flat, I reckon, with this. But obviously, t over time. That's just been caved like in. Steps, could there? No steps. This is to stop people getting further into the moat system. The French. Wow, is that a fire extinguisher? Yeah, it's a fire extinguisher. Can't get it, folk. Whoa! Oh, yeah, here we go. Slippery, isn't it? Yeah. Look at that, folks. Look, baby. Yeah. <laughs> just get it unravels. Right then, folks, let's get up here. Alright, you'll be alright for now. Yeah. Shall I go behind you? Just, uh, go away. Yeah, just, yeah, be right there. Let's go. Ah, oh, use this as a balance. Around a tree. Oh, here we go. That's it. One sec, mate. Can't hear you. Around there. Then what we do? Just off the top of my head, like that. Boom, carabiner. One sec, mate. It's only basic techniques, folks. It's nothing crazy. I'm not a rock climber, so this is just basic stuff. There you go. Now, tangled rope can go down the bottom. How does it get tangled? It's awful stuff. That's the only thing I hate about rock climbing and stuff is, is tangled rope. Huh? No way it. Yeah. <laughs> watch out, mate. Oh, no. No, watch it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, 
Sorted. Is it short? <laughs> yeah, it's fine. Why are you actually tying it to me then? Is it ready? Why well, I'm coming down. Oh, you're coming down. If we had a uh, thingy, what? harness would be a bit better, a bit safer. Yeah. But unfortunately, Chris has got the harness. I'm just shouting sorry. <laughs> and, uh, I don't know you have a harness. Yeah, I've done a bit of climbing years ago. So, how's that climbing? Sure, it's safe. Safe as houses, mate. What's the problem? Tree, big, big tree like that. You're going to have to uh, put your feet where it looks grippy. Like that. Where it make, try your feet foot, try where you're going to put your foot first. If it's slippery, maybe change to something else. That looks all right. Keep your hands on that rope. Yeah. Do not let go of that rope. Like that. Yeah, just keep hold of it. Because if you let go, you're going to fall. Dangerous stuff, folks. Yeah, you can do, mate. Yeah. yeah. Do it again. You right? Yeah. It's slippery, so we, you know this. Yeah, I know this. This won't. It won't um, slip as it's very grippy. So you can. As long as you don't let go, you'll be all right. If you slip, you just fall to the, the thing. Well, not one at a time, I think, because uh, yeah. I need the slack. I need the slack. See what I mean? Yeah. Try it, mate. Is your, uh, another way we could do it, I could tie the rope around your waist and no. pull you. No, no, no. Keep hold of the. Uh, Come on, that's all right. Keep hold of that rope. That's it. Put your foot there. Keep hold of the rope tight. Up. Just pull your, put your hands up more. Up, uh, up further up the rope. Yeah, put your foot back where it was. On that bit of there. There. See that? And that little stump sticking out. All right. Yeah. We had it a minute ago. See? Yeah. That's it. Yeah. And keep your hands on that rope. As soon as you let go, you're going to fall. That's the main thing. That's, that's it. Up onto that. Now the next one. That's it. Keep, it, keep on the rope, mate. No way. This here. Where? Foot there. Keep the rope. On the rope. All right. Oh, my God. Keep on the rope. Both hands. Two points of contact, folks. Yeah. Oh, oh, <laughs> right then, we're at the top. North lines then, folks. Excited? Never been up here, have yeah. you? How many years have you been talking about this? Quite a few, isn't it? Three. Three years. So this is the North Lines. I believe this is the longest stretch of moat in one go on the Western Heights now. Because I think the ones between the, like I said earlier, the one between the Drop Redoubt and the North Entrance was cut in 1967. I believe that was the date. Here it is. The Sally Port. Let's go. This is to get from inside the moat, up a spiral staircase, to the top of the moat. Like a, yeah, sally port, that's what it is. Doors and stuff at the end would have been barricaded, so the French couldn't get in. Is it that point I'd hate to hear something back? What? <laughs> like her voice. Try and, is there anything you can hold up here? 
brick wise, put your fingers in, then you put your leg in first. Too short. Yeah, there you go. Right. Well, the other, the other cases is to come in head first and lean on my arm and then crawl in. So we trouble with some of these places, they're uh, quite awkward. It's awkward. It's not, you know, it's not a small hole. It's just awkward. Here we are. He's got it. Right, we're in, folks. Let's go and explore. Right, Sally Port. Do you want to go first? the bricks and that on the floor. It's quite slippery actually, so get in there. So this is where the doors would have been originally. Oh, yeah. Big doors that would have been sort of shut to stop the uh, French getting through and getting into the fortress of the Western Heights. Can you go to the top of it? We're trying, it's very slippery. I forgot how slippery it was actually. Where does that go down there? Just nowhere, just uh, under the stairs. Oh wow. Well, it's just awkward folks, that's all. Awkward and you don't want to slip on the flints. You're all coming up right now. Hmm, behind you mate. Look at the scene above you. Stairs. It's quite high isn't it? That's looking down. Oh, my camera lens is steaming up. All right, be careful, mate. Yeah. Sketchy. Jesus. Oh, there's the top. Oh. What's up there? Just the top of the finger bomb. Look onto that bit there, look. Where? On there. This little ledge. Here? Yeah. Oh, Come. I need to find three. Candle is just wet. That's the top. Can we get back down? I'm just slipping. <laughs> yeah. Alright, well, you might as well put the phone away for the down part. Yeah. It's well wet, look at that. See you down there, folks. Nice and easy, nice and easy. No rush. All right, I've moved. Oh, we're near the bottom now, so. Doesn't mean we can speed up, folks. Oh no. All right, there you go. We're down, folks. Sally, Sally, Sally. What a Sally port indeed. Oh, sorry, oh no. What do you reckon on that then? Was it worth the three year wait? Yeah. It was. That's good. The experience, journey. Can you shine that torch here? What's that sound? Right. As you get a bit bigger, folks, it gets a bit harder um, to manoeuvre. Hey! <laughs> Folks coming out. Folks. Oh, wow. Oh, man, isn't it? I think the immigration centre shut in 2015. Um, but you can go up to the perimeter wall. We'll have a look at that. Did you go over there? Where? Over in the corner. Oh, can we go over there? We'll have a look, yeah. And um, take it from there, folks. That's what we're climbing just here. Wow. Look at this. I ain't been here for a long time. Wow. So behind this big wall is the uh, the citadels, or well, the immigration removal centre moat, the former immigration removal centre. It's mad, isn't it? What's around there? Nothing. Oh, I can't believe how big it is. Get to there, get a shot from there. Mm. <laughs> oh my god! 
Oh! Oh! No! Someone over there. Hurry up. Whoa! <laughs> Is it? Yeah. Huh? I'm going to slip. I'll chop through my bag up. I'll just leave. We're going back down there. We should climb it out that way. Enthusiasm. Enthusiasm, folks. No! Oh, no! Alright, how did you climb up that quick? That chop is really good. Oh! Right then, folks. One sec, I'm just doing some recording. Uh, yeah, so I hope you're enjoying these videos. They're, they're, you know, a bit of excitement. Something different. They're not very long videos. They're not. Nothing happening with the main explorers. We're still going to go crazy, going uh, exploring and that. And um, yeah, I'd just like to get out now and then, just out of the house, uh, show Kyron some pieces and that, and then take you on the journey, folks. Um, yeah, so he's having fun. You're having fun. I'm having fun, so that's all that matters. Isn't it, Kyron? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Don't let go. No. Oh. Right, I'm going to go first. Do you want the rope? Do you want the rope? Um, I don't know. It's my foot. Yeah, I need to go. We'll try and get them fawns out of the way. Can you don't screw up there? Yeah. Someone's garden out there, isn't it? Not going in the gardens, mate. Right, let's go. Right, so I'll climb up. Hello? And then, uh, yeah. Move the fawns out of the way. Yeah. yeah. I reckon I could. If the fawns ain't there, I'll be able to put them out of the way. Yeah. Maybe stand a little out of the way, just in case I fall. Cameras everywhere, folks. <sighs> oh, I can see the moat wall to the citadel. Yeah. yeah. The inner bit. Yeah. The inner part. All right. All right, I'm up. But stay there because I need to move some more fawns. Yes. I'm going to need the rope here. Huh? I will need the rope. Yeah, I'll get it set up. Okay. I only brought one, didn't I? Oh, so you could actually go down this way instead of going up the cliff? Huh? So instead of going up the cliff, you could go down this way? You could do, yeah, I suppose. Is it ready for me to come up? What's that? Can't come up. I can't hear you, mate. One sec, let me get this set up. I thought I lost the carabiner then, but <laughs> I um, only took one out. You up? No, I'm not. Right, I've got the rope off. I'm just going to move some fawns. Yeah. Just going to move some fawns here. What's the Fence. Oh. Strong, it's all right. Well, Let me get these fawns out of the way first, mate. One step at a time. Yeah. Yeah, if you could, mate. Hey, up. 
Do you want to, do you want to pull it? We'll rather wrap it all down, then we'll just pull it back up. Otherwise we've got two ropes and it's like, what one do you hold, folks? Yeah. Let's get these fawns out of the way. Let me test it. There's only one fawn that I've got. Where? Here. You'll be right. you won't be putting your head back like that, will you? You'll be well away. That's it, I think. What do you reckon? Did you hold that or just climb up? Right, before we go folks, oh. do you want to see Kyron's point of view with the GoPro? What do you reckon? you want the folks see that? Not really. Yeah, of course they do. Sure that's safe? It's 100% safe mate. Right, um. Just put all your faith into that rope because you know, it's fine. Where do I put my foot? All in the little bits where the bricks are missing. All the bits that stick out. I, I ain't gonna hold onto a rope yet, so I can get that then. I mean, it's, it's a challenge, folks. Have you Is there not... anywhere to put my foot? Uh, hold the rope, take the rope. Oh no. You can see, look, look with your eyes, look. What's beneath, that's it, see? See what's beneath you. Oh, I just hit myself in the head. You know, uh, if you haven't climbed, you know, quite things like this, it's quite a challenge for some people, folks. So, you know, be patient with um, climbers that haven't climbed before. Do you know what I mean, Kyron? I'm not really a good climber. No, nor am I. This is all right because it's quite small. Okay, feel confident on the rope? Yeah. When you get to the top, use the rope. Don't use the grass. Just use the rope and pull yourself right up. Yeah? Mm -hmm. Yeah, look at that, he's up. Not up yet. <laughs> just just don't don't start rushing, just nice and easy. Until you're on the top next to the fence. I'm up. On the rope, yep. See? Salted. Excellent. See you, folks. Have faith. Boom. Have faith in that rope. Right, I'm going to climb up. Oh. Right, we're going to take this. I'm going to get the other bag. Mm -hmm. And then uh, bring the camera up. I'll take this bag up first. So I like, I like this, actually. I, like, I do like climbing. I reckon that, fun? Yeah, we'll do it again. Climb down. Yeah, so it's down. See, I mean, when you got to this point, you should have just put your face in the road like that. Yeah. Right. right then, folks, we're back down. Camera in the bag. And let's get out of here. Right, so there's that wall from the top down there. So inside there is the Immigration Real Centre. That's the city there. Where? Where that was. Inside? Inside this moat. And that's where we that's where you wanted to climb up there. It's like fences and that gardens. Jesus. But that's the North Line. It's totally, totally overgrown. Let's go. So, uh, wow, so interesting. I love that, that rope climbing stuff. Uh, once. There you go. This is the second world war pillbox, the quad style, the Dover quad they call them. It's blocked in it? Yeah. Damn. 
Right then, folks, thanks very much for watching. Thanks, Kyron, for joining us yet again. Hope you enjoyed yourself. And uh, yeah. check, out, check out his channel, folks. And uh, we'll see you again in the next video. Thank <laughs> you.